But what are the odds of that happening? Oh, well. Hello everyone, welcome to Age of Empires, the definitive edition. Oh, this ought to be fun. First, I kind of like the pirates one. March with this story this storied son of Rome from his cap Okay, I'm gonna start from the beginning. Gallius Julius Caesar carried the highest virtues of the Roman Republic, but his ambitions would cause the Republic's downfall. March with this storied son of Rome from his captivity by Cilician pirates to his expedition to the ends of the earth, and from his conquest of Gaul to his crushing victory of his rivals. Discover why Roman emperors would proudly bear his name for centuries. Awe Kaivzar. Sorry, I forgot his name is oh, Kaiser, not Caesar. Oh, the rumors when the rich families in Rome heard that the young Caesar of the Julii family had been captured by Cilician pirates. Thank the gods that you are free now. I had hoped to dissuade you from raising a fleet and attacking the pirates to exact your vengeance instead of returning to Rome and your family. But I see you have made up your mind, and knowing your late father, I recognize this stubbornness runs in the family. So... Set sail, young Caesar, and redeem your family name once and for all. Objectives. Destroy all enemy docks. If Caesar dies, the mission will be lost. Or Kaiser, I guess however you want to pronounce it. Opposition will become stronger as you sail farther from Roman territory. Certain docks are easier to, attack, to destroy by attacking from land. Indeed. Born to an aristocratic family. I'm sure you can read this on your own. I'm gonna try to make it as slow as possible that way. You know what? Standard sounds good right now. Mm. Right. Got it. I'm gonna go with moderate. If you have moderate to severe Age of Empires, Age of Empires. Starting a new game. Yes, indeed. Excellent. What are the... What are the hotkeys? How do you quick save? Because I get the feeling that's going to come in handy the most. Oh, about to say. I thought it crashed there for a second. Making me scared. Oh, close. Got it. Come on, close. You're, you're actually making me nervous now. Come on. Okay, thank you. Thank you very much. Okay, game settings. Where's the hotkeys? <laughs> Let me just check out the hotkeys real quick. It's taking forever to load anything. That's really making me nervous. You gotta understand. Okay, uh, I don't see anything. Attack ground, okay. Scout, bowman. Scroll, okay, game commands. This is probably what I meant to do. Okay, where where is the part where you save? Is it even possible? Go to town. Okay, menu, objectives, save game, here we go. I'm gonna make this F5. And of course, you know what? I don't think there is a load, so I'm just gonna keep that alone. F5 is good, or at least that's what I'm familiar with. Intimately familiar with. Okay. You must enter a name to save the game. Okay. Uh, let's play. That work? Do I have to enter one in every time? Uh, okay, override it. Sure, why not? Huh. It's lagging a lot more than I thought it would. Is it because I've got the graphics settings up too high? Maybe it is. Maybe I'm a little too over-eager. I probably shouldn't have it up this high. Especially since I'm also... Oh, okay. <laughs> Anti-aliasing, let's turn that off. Black Mac Fog. Not just really sure what that does, but okay. I'll turn that down. You know what, everything else looks good, I think. Okay. It'll have to do. Right click, baby. Still not very stable though, it's weird. 
You'd think my computer would be able to run it with, with ease, even while recording. Although, it is, uh, it is a newer game, so it might not be too big of a surprise. But then again, the game doesn't look all that amazing. I mean, don't get me wrong, it looks pretty good, but it doesn't, look, it doesn't exactly look like the best game out there. It doesn't look like something that should o easily overpower a GeForce GTX 1050 Ti 4GB. And yes, I will point out, point that out as much as possible, because why not? Hello. At least uh, the music has been remixed and sounds pretty nice, too. I'll give them credit, it looks good. Even if it seems like it could be better optimized. I'm not sure. Kill him, Caesar! Kill him! Kill them all, I say! Get revenge against those nasty pirates! For daring to get between you and Rome. For daring to mess with Rome. Die, you freak! Huh. They actually spill blood. That's pretty cool. Actually. Are there specific graphic settings beyond just uh, those few that I've seen? Okay, come on when the game... Okay, this time the game actually did crash. Hang tight real quick. Okay, back. Hopefully it won't take too long. It's weird, though. That it would lag like this. I turned off most of the graphical settings, but... I turned the fog back on because I figured that that wasn't exactly influencing the frame rate that much. Or at least it shouldn't be. It would, it would seem kind of weird for it to be. I don't get why it's making me choose the name every time. You'd think after the first time I would realize, oh, I just want to save over this. Then again, I get, I suppose in this kind of game, any kind of screw up can have lasting consequences later on in the game, so I guess they want you to be able to make new saves. That way, if you made an earlier mistake, you can rectify it. It's not just an in-the-moment kind of game. You, you can legitimately screw yourself up if you don't plan ahead to some extent. What I gotta do is kill these guys first. Come on, man. Okay, time to kill you. Here we are. Not too bad. Oh. Wow. Actually, further than I thought. Because I know once you get... Yeah, once you get here, this is where the real meat of the game begins. In case it wasn't obvious. Okay, come on. Let's just go over here. Alamar. Yes. Alamar. What happened to Rogan and the other original Age of Empires things? Wonder. No, I'm looking for a town center. Ah, right, here we go. Cool. It's cheaper Omus. to build a town center. Omus. Omus. Oh, at least they have that much, right? Omus. 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 <laughs> ah, magical. Probably gonna do a one off of this though, because for some reason it does not like my computer very much. As if it is an obvious why. Now, let's build some ships. I get the feeling I'm gonna get attacked from the sea. Yep, right now. Damn it. Move, move back. 
Get it within tower range. Ah, frick. Frick. This is gonna suck. Damn it, they're already attacking. They're not, they have no chill whatsoever, do they? They're not even gonna give me a chance to defend myself or even plan my defenses out. This garbage. It's bad. Are you an idiot? Go back. Repair the tower, man. Oh, frick. They're surrounding me. What the hell? What is this all about? This is ridiculous. Caesar, what are you doing? Get over there. And stay. Okay, stand ground. There you go. Stand your ground. This sucks. Okay, do I have a... I don't have anywhere... Okay, I, actually I do. That's not true. I do have re enough resources. But damn. This is gonna be hard. This is already a struggle for survival right there. Ah, crap. My ship is down. This sucks. Man, they have no chill. How the hell are you supposed to have a chance here? This sucks. I, I swear, I just got started and it's all like I'm already dead. I'm already gonna die. Okay, clearly starting this game on freaking moderate was bad. Quit. Screw it. The pirates have made a mockery of your boast to return and eradicate them. Rome is disappointed, but because you paid for the expedition personally, there will be no recriminations. The job of eliminating the pirates has been given to a real man, Pompey. You can go along to keep his torso armor oiled. <laughs> okay, that's funny. That's pretty funny, I'll admit. Let's go with standard, I guess. Clearly, I was trying a little too hard. I was a tryhard. Let's try this again on a more manageable setting. And I'm going to skip past all the fluff, and I'll just get back to you once I actually have the town. Hang tight again. There, I'm back. Hopefully this time, things will go a bit smoother. This time I immediately started upgrading, well, researching the trireme. That way, once I actually start building them, they will be of a more defensive quality. Higher attack, higher health, pretty much higher everything that you need to survive. Hopefully, now things will back off enough for me to actually build anything. <laughs> Wouldn't that be great? Wouldn't that just be so magical? If we were to just give me some breathing room here. Just saying. Just saying, man. Oh. There's a villager over here. Alamos. Well, isn't that nice? Alamos. Let's see. Sentry tower. No, I'm looking for something else. Uh, storage pet. Here we go. Let's see. Well, I may as well put it Columbus, back there. Columbus. Even though there's some stone right there, the wood is probably more important because this is a map that takes place almost exclusively on the sea. Are you for real, man? This is basically casual difficulty. What the hell? And yet I'm still having trouble. Holy crap. Oh, and the game just crashed again. That's lovely. Hang tight. Okay, I'm back. Maybe things will go a little smoother this time. Who am I kidding? It never goes smooth. I don't even know what to do. Okay, chop some wood. Clearly what I gotta do is pump out the war galleys. Because I cannot afford to wait until I can upgrade them. That is, That has been made abundantly clear. As if it wasn't obvious already. Okay, Caesar, you're gonna have to go all the way over there. Just, just go park in the corner somewhere, and it'll be fine. Stand your ground, though. Actually, go this way. We'll, ha we'll have another, another villager that can help pump out the wood faster. Because apparently, you can never be too safe. You can never be too careful. It's ridiculous. But hey, that's just the way it's got to be. Oh, right. Okay. 
storage pit. Just put it in the extreme corner possible. Okay, uh, let me check. I'll just park him right there again. Frick. Already. It's ridiculous. Ridiculous. Well, at least it's being attacked on two fronts. That might uh, that might just help. And they are just triremes. It could be worse. I mean, hell, I could be attacked by catapult triremes. That would just be sucky. Crying out loud, shoot that thing. Villager, go. Repair. Make repairs. Emergency repairs while it's fighting. Try to try to repair it. Try to keep it from being destroyed. There. If I just do this, I have the I have the upper hand. Excellent. Bro. Keep repairing it. It's up to you to prevent it from being destroyed completely. Actually, I can just do this. That was a thing in the original game, too. Damn it. Or I would be able to if it wasn't for the fact that. It's simply not going to, it's probably not going to make up for the gap in power. Ah, for crying out loud. Now they've got transports. Great. Really freaking great. Okay, Caesar, you may as well help. Just, just kill him. You got a lot of health. It'll, it would take a, a lot of attacks for them to actually get the better of Caesar. Frick, this sucks. Okay, upgrade to Trireme, I guess. Prioritize that. Because otherwise, I'm gonna die. I will not survive at this rate. Help, help War Galley. Do whatever you can. Just do something. That'll be good. That'll be swell. There you go. That's more like it. Damn, it's gonna take a while to research triremes. I hope that that doesn't become a regular thing, or at least uh, at that frequency. I hope I at least get some breathing room for the next freaking attack. Having some more villagers might help. I hope my kid, it really will help. I desperately need as much as possible. Uh, okay, cool. That villager is already chopping wood. Excellent. Okay. I think you're done. I think I think that the tower is well enough to fixed that we can focus on more pressing matters, like chopping wood. All the wood. Get all the wood in the world. It doesn't matter. All of it. Frick. How much wood? Yes. All of it. Leave none behind. Ah, okay. Cool. You suck. Well, at least these ones are just scout ships. Weak scout ships. I have the. I actually have the technological advantage against them. Oh, and it's only gonna gonna widen the gap as I upgrade it into a trireme. Even though it's kind of worse for wear. Repair. No, you idiot. Stay right there. Attack. There we go. Now it's a trireme against some scout ships. They don't have a chance. All of a sudden, they're the ones who are outmatched. See, look, he had to go around just to get close enough to be able to strike me. To get within its striking range. Yeah, take that, you prick. It's about time I get the upper hand for once. You were getting by on the tougher guys, triremes, but now, now where are you? Now you're the one who's outmatched, at least at the moment. It may have been a little hard getting set up, but now I think I'm getting into a groove here. Go this way, go this way. Let the villager repair you, that would, that would be great. Villager, what are you doing? Don't stop just because you can't get to it right away. Keep trying, man. Thank you. There we go. 
Everything should be in order now. Or at least it's looking a lot better than it was in the beginning. See, look at that. In fact, its ship is the one that's about to be destroyed. Excellent. Now it's your turn, Brick. You can go on a one-way trip and trip to hell. Ah, why not? Join in for fun. I really don't need a second one, but why not? Let's really make it clear what happens to those who screw with me. Okay, how do I group them together? Uh, group, group, there's a button, I know. Or maybe it's just a, a hotkey. Nah. Frick. It's supposed to be somewhere around here. Oh, right, it doesn't do the cursor, even if it's a custom cursor. My bad, just, uh, give me a, allow me to, oh, crossfire. No, 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 no. Frick. Okay, capture cursor, there we go. My bad. There. Oh, uh, okay. Still not capturing the cursor, so you'll, you'll just have to take my word for it. Somewhere around here, there should be a group button, but there isn't. I guess I'll just have to look it up. Game settings, hotkeys. Okay, game commands. Where's the group button? Where's the friggin' group button, huh? It's weird. There doesn't appear to be a group button. Now that's just weird. So you're saying that in a way, it's actually less complicated than the original Age of Empires? It actually lost something? Oh, focus group, what the? Select merge group. Okay. Okay then, fair enough. There we go. Wait, what? I shifted though. Okay, shift one. Ah, fine, forget it, forget it. I don't even care. Obviously I'm specifying that request towards the one that can actually repair. For freaking real, man. Okay, attack the stone thrower immediately. Priority number one, destroy that damn thing before it causes any trouble. Good, good. Man, this is uh, quite a bind I'm in here. But once you get past the initial little hurdle, at least um, it seems to settle down just enough that you can build yourself up somewhat. Okay, I don't have any I don't have any food whatsoever. That's uh, obviously going to be a problem. I mean, I don't re I don't really need it immediately, imminently, right at the moment, because right now my priority is clearly set on naval dominance, which is going to require wood and lots of it. But at some point, I'm going to need to farm. Okay, fine. Let's get a farm going. Homus. 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 No. I think. No, oh, man. Wow, how's it How's it that on the original game they were better about going through spaces than in the remake, where it should be easier because it's in 3D? You know, smoother. Everything's smoother. It's weird. It's weird when you notice that the original game is in some ways more complex, more intricate than this. I, I just don't get it. There we go. That ought to help. Ah. I'm kinda, I kind of miss the sheep sound, you know. Maybe with other sound, other animals in the background, but there's just no lamb anymore. I mean, yeah, that's kind of cute too, but it's not as iconic as... Just saying. It's my opinion, though. Okay, I can afford to get one more to the population. Yep, I've hit my population limit. If I want any more than this, then uh, I have to build some houses. Isn't that just fun? Isn't that just peachy? Diplomacy? Yeah, there's no diplomacy here. Everyone's an enemy of me. They're probably allied with each other in their mutual hatred of me. Objectives. Got it. 
Huh, interesting. There, there really needs to be a more comprehensive graphics setting menu. Just saying. That'd be nice. And it'd also be, of course, it would also be nice if the game crashed a little less, but okay. Hang tight again. You know, it's just weird. Does the do the sounds actually sound more anemic in general? It's weird. Also, I realized that I apparently hadn't saved in long enough that now I am reduced to one try room again, or at least was, and then was again because I built one and then the first one got destroyed because I was too busy built. I was too preoccupied fixing the tower. It hadn't occurred to me that it was about to die. You know what? That's fine. I guess. Just destroy that thing quickly. Oh, crap. This again. This freaking thing again. This sucks. This is bad. This is very bad. Okay, it's not too bad. It's not too bad. As long as I can get everything in a working order. Well enough. There we go. Come on. Come on, buddy boy. Actually, it might be a little better if I got all those wood choppers to chop th this wood instead because it's a lot closer to its destination, you know? Chop. Chop this. Chop this right here. What the? Is that a villager right there? Oh, okay. Weird. What the hell's happening? Why are you just standing there? It's weird. Go ahead and cut these trees down. Be a lot closer to where you need. Okay. I'll have this guy build a few few houses. Okay, there we go. At least it at least the shift click still works. That would suck if it didn't. Okay. Let's get let's get a move on with this, huh? Nice. Nicely done. It's it's gonna crash again, isn't it? Yep. Just can't get enough of it, can it? You know what? Screw this. This this obviously isn't working out well at all. I'm not sure if it's probably I'm not sure if it's the game. I'm not sure it could be that the game is just terribly optimized. It could be that my hardware isn't quite up to snuff. But I mean my hardware isn't that weak, so I guess I could say that the game could be well better optimized, especially considering it's top-down view. The 3D graphics shouldn't have to be that elaborate. And in truth, the 3D graphics really are not that elaborate. I mean, if you look really close, the textures are, what, maybe PS3 quality at best? It's not that elaborate. It should not be this laggy. The only thing that I can think of that's even remotely close to being this taxing is the reflections, and in which case, you don't have to have reflections. Although, it should be screen space reflections, too, because it's, what, it's not like you're gonna be looking at the reflections of something that isn't also on screen. Unless it's like this. But, what are the odds of that happening? Oh, well, and it seems to be calling anyway, so it doesn't make any sense. But yeah, the game is lagging horribly, it, it just randomly crashes. This is not, this is not any fun at all. If I want to, if I want to let's play through Age of Empires, I'm going to let's play through the original Age of Empires that actually runs well on this computer. But that's here, that's neither here nor there. That is it for now. Thank you so much. I'm going to end this here. Sorry, I forgot to say that. I'm going to end this here for now. Thank you so much for tuning in with me. Make sure to spread this video around like my tongue ties and the pirates and the crashings and whole other things that are weird about this game. And I will see you next time. Now go out there and capitalize on life. Peace out, have a good one, and have a nice and pleasant day. If you enjoyed the content and want to stay up to date, I upload 10 a.m. and 2 p.m. Eastern Standard Time every single day. You can also subscribe and hit the bell icon or just check out the end screens right here.